SSL scan is intended to be run on Linux, but it can be installed on Windows. When you go out to the GitHub page for SSL scan, it's going to be the releases area here on the right hand side. Or you can scroll down into the README and there's a link to releases there as well. When you arrive over at the releases, you'll notice that some of the releases have versions for Windows. So for example, if I go to this version, there is Win 207 for Windows. I'm going to click on that and save the file. You can access the downloaded file in your downloads folder. So we're going to copy that zip file. And then we're going to go over to Program Files, create a folder called SSL Scan. And we're going to go inside that folder and paste the zip file. Now that we have the folder copied over, we're going to extract the contents of that zip and we're going to place those into the SSL scan folder that we created. Once the files are decompressed, they'll show up in the folder. And we don't need the zip file anymore. You can delete that if you like. Now we have the executable SSL scan.exe inside the folder C program files SSL scan. And we can execute it on the command line. So click on your shortcut to your command prompt, but you will need an administrator command prompt. So if you open the command prompt and it doesn't say administrator here in the left hand side, you can go back down to the shortcut and you can right click on it. When you right click, you'll get this extra menu and you can select run as administrator. So now you see the administrator indicator here at the top left corner. We'll change into that directory for SSL scan. And now we can run that binary, sslscan.exe. And you can run SSL scan from Windows.